consciousness is collective it can't be individualistic it is not possible and if any part or any one is excluded so it can't be a collective consciousness it can't you can't see it as a consciousness it has to be collective god is sub total if you exclude yourself from the universe so it is not total even you are a very important part of this universe while you undervalue yourself while you feel that god has forgotten you you feel that that there are desires which you are not able to achieve because the god maybe you feel that he is partial maybe god is not with you but without you including he can't be a god it is not possible for a god to call him a god if you are not included in it when you say a consciousness it is collective the collective vibrations of everything that you perceive through your five senses at the same time what you don't perceive through your five senses everything what you what energy you vibrate what energy the plants vibrate what at what energy the sun radiates whatever you are radiating the plants are radiating or the creatures around everything is radiating everything in unison is a collective consciousness and it affects you the same way as it affects the moon in the night because what moon is radiating the energy it is radiating it is affecting you at the same time what you are vibrating and that at that level of vibrations what you are radiating it is affecting to the moon as well i'll make you understand with a simple example for example if the more you go closer to fire you feel more heat and in the same way if you go nearer to the snow you feel cold in the same way even you radiate at some level at every moment if you are in a very happy mood you radiate positivity if your mood is not good or if you are angry or jealous or, or you are jealous you radiate something else but every time every moment you are radiating a lot of energy even when you are sleeping it is radiating if you are not seeing a flower still the fragrance is there in the same way if you are not conscious you are sleeping still you are radiating and that energy which you radiate affects everything around you at the same time what energy your the people around you radiates you also get got get affected with it so it might happen that when the time when you are meditating you are radiating a lot of good vibes good energy and at the same time it is affecting everything around you and that's what the sum total of it you call it aura for example uh, you have lot of positive thoughts your family has lot of th- positive thoughts and you stay together in a house and the collective thoughts the collective uh, consciousness of your house you call it as aura so we have an individual aura and at the same time there's a collective aura which is affecting you if you go to a some place where everyone is sad that everyone is uh, filled with negative thoughts suddenly you start to feel bad you start to feel that your energy is draining because of the aura around it so when you understand that every thought when you think you are not just designing your life at the same time you your thought is of affecting everybody if i say everybody it includes all humans all creatures all animals mountain sun moon stars everybody so you are that powerful only thing is you are not conscious about it and when you become such mindful about your thoughts when you become mindful about that what you think is very important it's very very important it you it will you will not just change your life at the same time you will change 
the life of everybody around you at the same time you can also change a lot of uh, make this universe more positive so that is the collective consciousness i'll give you another example if you drink a tea you feel the taste of sugar you don't see sugar in it if you you uh, feel the taste of tea powder you see the color and you know that some elements have came together and this tea was prepared in the same way you may not see everything but what you feel is very important you are contributing to the universe collectively how it tastes it's very important and at one firstly it will affect you firstly so you can contribute to this collective consciousness by making yourself individually more positive more vibrant become conscious about your thoughts and when you do that uh, you radiate a lot of good vibrations at the same time when it happens that you radiate you start radiating lot of positive vibrations and it is affecting the entire universe so there is another element to it you are positive but collectively collectively there are people around you who are not positive but if you maintain your thoughts while because if there are two more uh, multiple people who are thinking negative and you are alone who are thinking positive so it might happen that you will get this thought that you should start thinking negative so you start feeling better and you feel like you are one with those people and that is why that is how ne- uh, negative energy around us affects but you have to maintain your positivity your good thoughts despite what people are uh, thinking about you or trying to throw uh, despite what they are trying to throw on you you stay you stick to your positivity it will make your aura more vibrant more stronger and at the same time the the negativity of the other people will not harm you so that is very important that what you give out because the moment you start giving out negativity it will come back to you many fold maybe instantly you don't see it but it is coming back so you might feel that there are people around you who are negative but still their life is very good it is not like that you maybe you don't know what others are going through so the best thing is you start becoming mindful about your own thoughts you start becoming more mindful about this fact that you are a very 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 and at the same time equally important for this universe the way the moon is important what moon is radiating is important at the same time what you radiate is also important at the same time what you radiate is affecting everybody like this <coughs> like sun is radiating heat and is affecting the whole universe it is very evident you see it very clearly at the same time if you become conscious more and more we go to meditation you see that even you radiate what you radiate is also affecting everything the same the same way the sun is affecting start becoming conscious about what you feel what you think and just focus on your individual aura so gradually you will become mindful about collective consciousness when i just the first thing is to begin with your own thought what you are thinking next your what next thought it uh, your uh, it is coming start becoming mindful about your thoughts and that's how you will change your individual aura and just see each the phase of this entire universe and the more and more people become positive it is better for the universe so i invite you to join me on this path of meditation